Flossie Wong-Stahl was a virologist and molecular biologist. This means she studied viruses and conducted her research at a molecular or very small level. In 1973, she began research into retroviruses at the National Cancer Institute in the USA. A retrovirus inserts a copy of their genome inside its host cell and takes it over in order to replicate. In 1983, Wong Stahl and a team of scientists identified HIV, the human immunodeficiency virus, as the cause of AIDS, acquired immune deficiency syndrome, a disease that reduces the body's immunity. Just two years later, in 1985, she became the first scientist to clone HIV, which means to make an exact genetic copy of the virus. She also completed genetic mapping of the virus. This made it possible to develop a HIV test. In 1990, Wong Star moved to the University of California, San Diego, where she focused her research on gene therapy. She used a ribozyme molecular knife, an enzyme designed to destroy genetic instructions used by HIV to slow down the growth of HIV in cells. This reduced the virus's ability to reproduce and it meant it spread more slowly. This proved very successful. It meant the virus made only 10 to 30% as many copies of itself as it would have done had it not been subjected to the enzyme treatment. This research was instrumental in finding a treatment for AIDS.